Hey, it's Larry Martin. Wanted to talk to you real quick about first time home buying. And I was going to talk to Kathy because she does work with a lot of the first time buyers. And what do you enjoy about working with first time buyers? I enjoy the fact that it's all brand new. Okay. And that they're very excited, which they should be. This is a big deal, yeah. right? It, and it's a big deal to buy a house. And, and they're excited, and I love to be there and to be the person that gets to help them walk through the process. Right. So now that you're at the age where some of your kids have already moved out, right? Mm -hmm. You're helping some of your friends' kids yeah. buy their first house. Yeah. And um, I think you give really great advice with it. What do you, en what do you enjoy most about helping your friends' kids? Um, well, I kind of almost feel like a mom by extension. You know, yeah. I feel proud of them. I'm, I'm uh -huh. actually very proud of them that they've saved money and that they're doing this really big grown-up thing yeah. um, and that they're setting themselves up for financial success. Okay. Very good. So this is Lisa Leister. She's with Grand Rapids Mortgage mm -hmm. Company. And she does all, not all, but a lot of our loans. What do you like about working with first-time home buyers? Well, I, I often say that if I were to live my life over again, I'd probably be a teacher. I love teaching, okay. and um, I love educating first-time home buyers and explaining the whole process, and um, whether it be, you know, credit, um, saving money for the down payment, um, and just, um, uh, you know, budgeting for the future. Okay. Let's back up a minute. You yeah. said credit. So mm -hmm. uh, as a first-time home buyer, sometimes they don't have a lot of credit, mm -hmm. right? So... We use the FHA program primarily if they have a limited credit. What do they have to have score-wise, roughly speaking? I know they have to have good credit. Mm -hmm. So what is kind of a basis, basic on that? Well, I mean, we can do um, we can do loans as low as six hundred. Okay. But you know, listen, if, if I were advising my kids, and I try to treat my clients, especially yeah. my first-time home buyers, like they are my kids. You really do. And um, I really say, hey, try to get your credit as high as possible by doing things like, for obviously, the most important thing, pay pay everything on time. Mm -hmm. And um, and then, you know, building your credit, whether it be by when you, your first car, again, paying that on time. But get your score as high as possible because, believe it or not, the rate does have something to do with, or your credit, excuse me, has a lot to do with the rate and how expensive your payments are going to be. But, uh, but again, give me a call on that and we can discuss that and go through it and uh, might be surprised at how low your credit um, uh, can be and still be able to purchase a home. Yeah. And also, if they have a low cre lower credit score, there's some things that they mm -hmm. can do, some adjustments they can yep. make, and it could maybe bounce back. Um, yeah. yeah. I'm not a credit counselor, but we absolutely, I'm happy to go through it and mm -hmm. give some tips and ideas on how to, how to uh, increase your score. Okay. And the other thing I'm kind of excited about is the kind of the comeback of the VA mortgage is zero down, right? The RD, rural development. Yep. If somebody wants to buy in the country, they can buy for zero down. So for first time home buyers, I think we're really coming into a season where it's going to be really a fabulous time to buy. If you're a parent or a grandparent and you have um, somebody that wants to buy a house for the first time, have them give us a call. We're going to have the seminar in March. Uh, if you want to send us a message, we'll get you all signed up. And uh, we're really excited to help you. If you need anything, contact us. Have a great day.